Thank you for joining us for the fourth annual We Care Run Walk for Hunger. It's my privilege to be here today with Denise Daniel. She's the longtime race director. She's a minister at St. Peter's Church and World Outreach Center. And she's going to tell us a little bit more about the race and the We Care House and Garden that does such a terrific service for our community. Thank you, David. So the We Care House race, the Walk Run for Hunger race, is our fourth annual event, as David has said. We are have, have it annually as a fundraiser to support our We Care House. Our We Care House is the way that we give back to, to, to our community by providing food and clothing to those that need them. And then our garden is where we grow fresh vegetables, fresh produce, to supplement what we give out through our uh, We Care House. Again, this is an annual fundraiser that we have. This is our fourth year, so we're excited. We're also excited by the fact that we did not allow the pandemic to keep us from having this event this year. It's a different way of doing things. It's a different way of, of having it, but we're excited. We're excited because we don't let anything stop us. We keep <laughs> right on going. We keep right on going. And then the final thing you may be asking is, how do you want run a virtual race? Well, let me tell you. This is the way you run a virtual race. You can run it any day that you want to, between Sunday, November the 15th, Saturday, Saturday no. November the 21st. You can run it anytime you want to, anywhere you want to. All you have to do is upload your race results uh, by using your own GPS or your uh, Fitbit or the race store and upload it to the race site. And then finally, what we want you to do is to take a, a selfie. We're all good at taking selfies. Take a selfie and hashtag it with the SPWOC We Care 5K. Now, if you don't remember all of that, it's okay. It's going to be in your race packet. So, again, I, we, we want to invite you to join us, get your teams together, join us for the St. Peter's virtual 5K Walk Run for Hunger. And you don't have to have a special watcher app. You can also just go out and do it on your own, time it on a watch, or do an untimed and you're still a participant in contributing to this great cause. Yes. And am I correct, already in 2020, you've served more than 5,000 people? Absolutely, we have served more than 5,000 people and our numbers have increased exponentially because of everything that people are going through right now with the pandemic. So again, we need your help by supporting this race. Yeah, we're here at St. Peter's and the St. Peter's people, that's a regular thing and you take that for granted. Yeah. Serving 5,000 people is a huge service to yes. our community. Yes. We thank you. Thank you, thank you. Please join us.